right, hey dudes, I'm gonna show you a, what I got up here. My brother's bow just came in. He got a Phoenix Long. So he hasn't even touched it yet since it's came back. I'm gonna show you what I got here. I made him a string. He bought a spool of 452X orange string. And here's his, his factory string that came with it. And we'll save that for a spare. So, I made him some gold tip 300s. These are pretty much the same exact thing as what I'm shooting. He fleshed with AAE hybrid 26s on a hard helical out of the Arizona Easy Fletch. We put, put an old PSE 8 arrow quiver on there and I just made some aluminum brackets and, these, and it bolts right to the riser. Real nice. Dan, he shoots the four finger true fire release. Tied him on a loop, a kisser button, no peep sight, and he has a, an HHA slider sight, which he's gonna put a new sight tape on. And here's his new cool upgrade. The Limb Driver Va Vapor Trail Pro V. And this is hooked up on an Oneida. I have not seen anybody uh, hook these up to limb drivers hook them up to Oneidas so I was sitting here thinking about it and I couldn't find pictures of anything so I got my own idea this limb driver the way it's oriented the cutout for the little button head screw just tells me it wants to go to the top limb so get that up there on the top limb stink I don't really recommend modifying your bows unless you're confident in your abilities, but I was wanting to show you my mo modified nut bar I made that will accept a limb driver cord that makes it the most reliable that I could possibly think of. This is not going to bend or break or fail in any way. It's a piece of galvanized steel that I cut out, drilled the holes, and custom made just to fit a limb driver cord. That is the only way, if I was gonna shoot a drop away and a sight set up like this, that I would feel confident in it never failing. But I, I don't shoot with sights or a drop away rest, even though I have shot with drop aways on some old compounds with shooting no sights and done it really accurately. I really liked it a lot, but I just don't, I just use the flipper rest on the, on my Phoenix bows, which, most of you watching this know that. So that's it. Really good setup. This is the Phoenix Long, guys. And it's going to fit him good. He's about a 30 inch draw. And I bear shaft tuned this yesterday. And I mean, it's shooting them dead down the pipe. Perfectly straight. 100 grain point. Just your standard gold tip arrow. So, so that's it for that.